Well, I'd say, I mean, d- just reinforcing the message, spending lots of money on your pit display does not equal points. Yeah. No, yeah. That's You've got to look at your marking criteria. Is it meeting the marking criteria? Mm. Not, have you got an enormous display with loads of screens, with a laser projector, with all the stuff that looks really fancy? We don't care. It's We look at how it's scoring against those points. Yeah. And also, we think, about, you know, there's some other teams that have come from, you know, countries that aren't, haven't got as much money. Mm. And I've really struggled to put their to get the, the funding to come. Mm. You know, we, we do not want a situation where the richest team wins. And we we've discussed that in previous episodes yeah, whether yeah. pit displays are, are pay to win. But I think yeah. considering that, you know, you could spend forty thousand dollars on a pit display mm. and if it doesn't assess like it doesn't match any criteria, you're not gonna get anything. And that's the biggest thing. Everything is assessed against the criteria. Mm. Read the criteria. We've said that so many times over the past two years. I think we'll name the episode <laughs> this. Read the criteria. Read the criteria, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, we had a team at Singapore and we asked them how they went about designing a pit display, and they said, Oh, we contacted a firm that made display stands and we outsourced it all to them. And we we're like, Okay. Right. Yeah. Um, they did not score many points at all. And I suppose, yeah, that's that's an example of pay to win, but um, they didn't. They, they paid, they, they, but they, they did not win. <laughs> they did not win because it didn't meet any of the criteria. Yeah. And yeah, they look nice, but it didn't meet any of the criteria. And I think that's the whole underlying thing of of portfolios, pit displays. They may look nice, they may be expensive, but in the end, we're working to a criteria, mm. and working to a criteria is another thing that any field you go into, mm. you get whether it's, you know, teaching, I've got to work to a curriculum as a teacher, um, in a business that has lots of clients, you're gonna have contracts, you need to work to those. Mm. And it's it's a skill that everyone needs to, as an engineer, you've got specifications, yep. you've got standards, um, it's everywhere. Okay.